Let's get out of here. This place is no better than where we've been. Okay. So let's go... Let's go this way. We've gone too far in one direction. What I'm going to do is kind of aim for any islands over around here. Let's see. So you can find dead explorers around. What would you think if you could start over as a different character in the same world? Maybe after a time. Buildings have decayed and no re revealed map. Actually, I think that would be really fun. I think it would be really neat if you could occasionally run across, like, your old base. You know, half half destroyed. You know, the farms have stopped working or entirely just, just gone. Couple of tools. It would definitely make the game easier. Uh, but I, I think it would be kind of a, a neat thing to do. Just be like, yeah, I remember these landmarks. I can work with this. Uh, and it's kind of more of like a pick up the pieces type situation than anything else. Uh, I'm not entirely sold on like how good it would be. But it would still be kind of fun. I think. I'm trying to avoid deep ocean here if I can manage. Because I would like to... I would like to... Avoid going too far out here. This is probably just indicating... We're close to Swamp Island, which is not super useful. Okay. Well, we've got an area over here. There might be... There might be another island. I really wish you could see... I... No, son of a... This isn't... This isn't it. We're next to the fog wall, and I can't do that. It's a significant sanity down, I believe, traversing that. And one way or another, I don't want to have to transfer from one to the other. Buddy, there's no reason for me to set up a winter base on Crab Island. I don't need winter food. Food is the least useful thing in the game. This is not standard... Uh, this is not standard Don't Starve. This is uh, shipwrecked. So, once I get a farm down, like, we're golden. It's just a matter of finding a good place to stop. Uh, and we have yet to find that. Oh, that's bad. Let's see. Uh, you can, you can, uh, catch fish from, 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 uh, group, from shoals and stuff. I don't really mess with it, but you can totally do so. Uh, I think you need, you need spiderweb to make a fishing rod, which is part of the problem. Because... I don't have a lot of spiderweb. I guess I could go back to that, like, one particularly shitty island. Uh, with all the spiders and stuff. Uh, I think you can also make, like, a trawling net, come to think of it. Which gives you a bonus, too. But... I've never messed with it. In fact, you know, the, the idea of trawling... Honestly, there's, like, a lot of food-related stuff. Um... Built into Shipwrecked. But there's actually very little need for it. Like, the starvation part is the least concerning bit. I've been running around for eight days and I've yet to build a single farm. Uh, which is, you know, usually, like, my number one thing to do. I've, I mean, I've got 26 shit just lying around in my inventory. So with luck... With luck, we'll find uh, another sandbar over here. But with luck, we'll find a place to actually sit down and build some of these farms. Okay. Oh, we've got we've got a slightly shallower zone over here. Maybe maybe we'll get lucky. Oh, it's just a continuation, but still. Didn't know I streamed. Fairly uh, upfront about me streaming night constantly. Oh, well, I guess I'm not terribly communicative. I guess if you don't stay up late and you don't notice the announcement videos, you could easily miss it. Okay, here we go. Shallow section, shallower section. Come on, give me an island. Give me a good island. We're still within range of uh, Poop Island, so I can work it. Unfortunately, the this boat's taken some heavy hits. Just because work, oh. working against the current ain't great. Okay, yeah, we're still within range. I do like the fact that uh, by like the color coding on the sandbars, you can actually tell where the island's going to be. Or at least to have a good feel for it. Because the brighter it is, generally, the more likely you are to find land. Or, in this case, nothing. Well, let's go the, this way first and see what we can do. Let's see, how do you think co-op would affect Shipwrecked? I think, for starters, uh, having 
multiple people on a boat would be fascinating. Up oh, there we go. We got land. Land ho! Please don't be land crap. Ooh. Ooh. Okay. I've still got my torch out, don't I? We got a slot machine. Interesting enough. Do we have any buffaloes out here? Nope. And... Well... This is a place. But, it did give us a clue. Never mind. That is not a useful clue. Given the situation. Okay. So, next up is... Probably just going along this area for the time being. Yeah, multiple people would be really interesting. I think it would actually work out quite well for um, for this mode, honestly, just because having people that can go out to different islands to strip mine them all at the same time could be really useful. Like, if you could get a really, really good group going uh, for the initial start of Shipwrecked, you'd effectively be able to... Um... You'd, you'd effectively be able to... I mean, solve my current issue, which is just a sheer and utter lack of... really should stop eating that seaweed raw. Um, complete and utter lack of a place to set up shop. Look, I don't think we have enough time here. Okay, let's just explore to the end of the sandbar. Yep, it's dead end. I'm not going to try hail marrying it here. We don't have enough time. Let's just go back to that tiny little zone cook and eat our seaweed and just be sad about things. Man, I finally got packing bagums. And it's almost day nine. Yeah, watch the hounds show up. Mm, probably. But yeah, the ability to split up and search for resources would be amazing. And because you can farm during the winter, uh, the food focus would be removed. So I'm actually looking forward to uh, playing this multiplayer more than, um, more than I'm looking forward to playing standard Don't Starve multiplayer. Just because a lot of the a lot of the problems aren't just simply aren't there. Okay. Well, fine, let's cook some food, eat some food. Okay. Uh, yeah, don't be sad. Uh, whoops. Didn't mean to do that. I'm not too sad, it's just I really want I really want a place to set up base. I am ready. I I am ready. I am willing. And it is not it is just just isn't okay but yeah I want an island near near here if I can manage it so I wouldn't be surprised if there's an island over here there's probably also an island over there I don't know what I'm gonna do from there though consider going to bed Man, I am tired. There's something more more exhausting about running around just praying to find a base here. You know, we might as well grab the empty bottle. It might be useful. After how many days does the tide come? Uh, the tide never ne necessarily comes. I mean, it comes up, but it's based on the moon. So by day 11, I believe, the tide is at its highest. Wow. Yeah, definitely not an island for me to set up shop in. I'm going to be really, really damp by the time we're done. Okay. How's my raft doing? It's okay. That's not great. It's just okay. Yeah, I have both all the luck and none of the luck. I have all the resources to put up somewhere. But I don't have the somewhere to put up. Yeah, so it looks like... It's generally in my best interest at this point. To... Just keep going. I don't, yeah, setting up a base somewhere would be meaningless. Without seashells or flowers, we're screwed. What does the slot machine do? I used doubloons on it. I know that much, but I'm saving my doubloons because I need gold. Real bad. 
Oh, wow. The imaginary horrors will actually assault you. Uh, even on the ocean. Oh, that's not going to be good. I might die to insanity here. Oh, we got land. Land ho. It's rocks. That's, that's a good sign. Come on. The rest of this better be good. Yeah, watch my sanity. I'm watching it melt. It's not good. Please be more than just rock. Oh! Ooh, it's jungle. Well, there are flowers here. There's more gold. And more rock biome. Okay, let's just combat the massive sanity loss by harvesting as many flowers and then just shoving them in my face. Okay, so we've got Ultra Rock Biome. Haven't seen something like this before either. But it works, sort of? Wow. What a place. There are better ways than flowers and shells for sanity. None that I currently have available, as far as I know. But then again, I'm not exactly an expert at this game. Okay, come on, please be more than just these biomes. Damn it! I mean, look at these two! Awesome! Awesome! But all of them individually sucks. Come on. Maybe there's something up here? It'd be amazing if this is a massive island. I mean, it's got flint for days. So we got that benefit working for us. Yeah, there's nothing else here. Alright, probably time to go hop back on the boat. I'll come back here later, but at least my sanity's uh, above 100 now. So we're not going to have crazy double vision all the time. But it still hurts a little. It's the cute beanbag things. Pack and bagums. He's adorable. Evil flyer, evil flyer, evil flyer. Okay, we want nothing to do with those. Yeah, I will come back here later. I know we've got gold, but at this point I'm desperate for a base. And without one, no matter how much gold we can get our hands on, we're sunk. Uh, but I'm definitely planning on strip mining this place as hard as I can. Okay. But yeah, I know, I know there are better ways to deal with sanity right now. But I do not have access to them normally. Yeah, maybe the next update will add world options. I hope so. Okay, so where do we go? From here. Probably this direction. Uh, where's the... yeah. I mean... I can always just do, like, a day trip or something like that, but I really wish you could almost save the world seed, or... Hell. I'm ha I'm half tempted to look up, like, a reveal world cheat for some run at some point. Uh, you can make a flower hat for 12 flowers, which increases sanity a lot. This is true! However, uh, there's never been enough flowers for it to work. For that to even be useful. Have I tried terraforming? Uh, I mean, terraforming isn't... Terraforming's not gonna suddenly create resources where there are none. It's just going to change one group to the other. Uh, what I... What I, I mean, well, I guess what I could do is painstakingly transplant everything that I could want uh, from one place to another, but that sounds like a massive uh, issue. Yeah, your game has flowers for days. I haven't found a grass biome in, like, half an hour. Uh, not a lengthy one. We had a bit of jungle there, which had stuff. Um, but, I mean, I ate them all, yeah, but it was only six. And the last time I saw a flower was literally 3.30, which was 40 minutes ago. So yeah, watch my boat. My boat's okay for the time being. Not great. But this has been, this has been a roller coaster ride of a, a run. Um, Okay, we've got desert. We've... well, not desert. We've got beach. We've got jungle. Come on. 
Give me grass. I can make do without, but I'd love a grass biome in, in and all of this. You know what's really sad? This is the island I started on. Okay. Let's start collecting some of these. I don't think we're gonna find a... I don't think we're gonna find what we need here. Let's check the other side of the jungle just in case. Well, one way or another, we're camping here tonight. Let's grab what flowers I can. Well, if I'm spending the night, I might as well go for the... Go for the gold. Uh, this is just such a... Painful run. It's not the worst. It's just demoralizing. It's like, just give me a good stopping point. Just give me a destination. Give me a place to belong. I'll die of starvation. Nah! My, my starvation is not a problem. I've got enough seaweed and berries to keep me alive. At least for a little while longer. Yeah, still nothing. Hmm. Do you still have the machete somewhere? Yep. Hmm. Guess let's make the garland. At the very least, and you eat the rest of the petals. Okay, do sand biomes get covered in water during the full moon? Uh, no. No, it's it's just based on where you are on the beach. Though, the further you... Um, actually, it doesn't look like the tide comes up on jungle biomes. Interesting. Guess I didn't know. I mean... Okay. Let's rethink this. Fuck it. We got wood, we got berries. We got a lot of shit. I can make it back. Long journey, I know. And we've got this over here. Nah, let's keep going for a little while longer. I'm still not satisfied. I'm really picky here. Okay. Uh, how much? I think I think my raft has enough for one more in it. One more little trip. Red mush tree. Adorable. I need more sticks. Okay, so how's the raft looking? Eh, it's a 25. Yeah, we'll be okay for one more. How's not starving going? Ah, I mean, the starv starvation thing's a little bit concerning, but I'm okay. Uh, it's more the finding a place to sit down. Um, I'm not looking for grass, necessarily. I'm just looking for... Uh... A decent spot to s stop. I'm being real picky, but, like, survival's hard enough as it is, and picking a disadvantageous stop is a bad move. Okay. Let's just keep going. I mean, maybe the X marks the spot is a good place to figure it out. How's my ship? Yeah, this is this, is this ship's last journey, where, whether I like it or not. We'll figure it out. Food. We'll be okay. We're probably going to sink uh, just as we start starving, so they are they're kind of mutually they're not mutually exclusive. And I'm a little bit more worried about this sinking thing first. Okay. And yes, I know two two limpets and two monster meat to surf and turf. That's not really the concern here. Like Yes, I realize my stomach looks terrible. But that was that was the main concern. Okay, so we're on the red island. Let's just shove these berries into my face. I got more things I can deal with. I wonder how the coconuts are doing. I should be concerned about that. But only a little. Okay, so we've got... This is probably just a deserted island. Damn it. 
What happens if you sink? You just die. If you have a life vest, you'll be... You'll be safe. But generally you just die. This guy drank himself to death. Son of a... We haven't found anything. Well, I guess if you got a life jacket like that, you'll be okay. Alright. X marks the spot. Let's make a shovel. I haven't done this yet. Ah! You know what? We should probably switch to an axe for this one. No! That's mine! That's my pelican! That's my pelican! Leave it alone! Mine! Mine! Understand? Mine! There we go. Chest has some doubloons and a red gem. Goody. And bone fragments. Still not the biomes we're looking for here. Well, let's keep wandering for a second. We might find something useful here, but I doubt this is going to have the biodiversity I want. Uh, we truly did go full circle. I'm tired. I'm just really tired. I think... It might not be a bad idea to start considering going to bed. As much as I like having pack and bagums, all we needed was a desert biome attached to a grassy biome and near some other resources so I wouldn't have to go boating forever to find a place. <sighs> But at this point, I'm demoralized, I'm tired. And we're not getting anywhere with this. Uh, I should have figured out how to make a rowboat, maybe, or gotten more thatch. I don't know. Either way. This is not going my... This is not going my way. We're almost out of wood. Well, last-ditch effort. One more island. I bet it's for the week. Restart the game. But at this point, I mean, it's 4 a.m. <laughs> I am wiped out. I was up till 6 yesterday, and I've got to start making stuff in the crock pot. So, let's go find that one island. If it's a thing, if it's a thing. Otherwise, we go to bed. This raft is going to get me nowhere. Is it? Ugh. Well, let's find out. I believe in me, who still just kind of believes tangentially in my ability to maybe survive here. I don't know. Well, we've got brain coral. This is largely not what we want, but it does mean that there's probably more land over nearby. Okay. And I don't even care if this raft sinks. It's going to be an emergency measure one way or another. Because, yeah, we have found nothing that satisfies me. Like, the last spawn was okay. This spawn is alright. Well, this one has not been anything that- like, my first couple runs had amazing stuff. That was good to go. But ever since, it's been... so very little. Yeah, I can't wait until they add world settings to this. It'd be- it would be so nice. We are last ditching it in the middle of the ocean. It is a bad place to be. I don't see us surviving this one. Well, at least we're going to be closer to land with this, but unfortunately... Ah, uh, you know what? It might be close to an island. Let's follow it. I mean, what's the worst that could happen? Truly, what is the worst that could happen here? Or you could, you could just dump us straight out to deep ocean. Alright, well, considering I have no, I have no, I have nothing. We have no land nearby. We have no islands. 
Unless we get really lucky in the next three seconds. I could just sit here holding a torch at night. Oh! Well, that's a blessing. Well, uh, we live to survive a little bit longer. Ha! Go right. No. So if you notice, there's different uh, colors. There's different colors on the um, on the ocean. Right? There might be an island, but it would probably be over here-ish. Uh, the lighter the ocean, the more likely you're going to find land on it. So in this case... In this case, staying in the lighter areas, you're going to find islands. Though I'm, I'm trying to steer clear of this area. Uh, we'll see. Come on, give me something. Give me something useful. Okay, we've got a sand barrier. Ah, oh, it's coral. But it's a different set, so there's potential here. Can't believe we got we got lucky with the full moon. Did not expect that one. Okay, uh, my garland still exists, so my sanity should be fine. I'm very wet though. Which is never a good situation to be in. Ah, oh, nuts. It looks like the sandbar exists only for this bit of coral. Unless we're lucky and extends past this direction. Nothing. Yeah. Patator, those... Those sound like great recipes for, uh... For this. Unfortunately... I don't even have a place to put a crock pot down, so there's like zero point to me even thinking about that, that sort of thing. Love to, though. But we'll see. Okay. Well. We might have found another landmass. We're within boating distance of Shit Island. Come on. Work with me here. Give me a thing. Everything is wet. This raft can't dodge waves. And admittedly, I've been trying a little bit. Okay. Oh, that was that was for somebody else. Okay. I was just like, mm. there's no islands here, are there? Well, this is a wash. I guess let's go this way. There's probably going to be an island between here and there. This raft is having a bad day. This raft is absolutely having a bad day. I'm having a bad day. This is not easy. Okay. Yeah, there's something over here. There's gotta be. Either that or I'm just in open water. No food. We'll eat the soggy seaweed. Which drops my sanity really freaking hard. Oh, man. Alright. I think we're going to insane ourselves to death here. Fine. Fuck it. I'm going to go out my own way. I'm just going to go straight. We're just going to go straight ahead. I'm going to get as soggy as I can. And either we're going to sink, or I'm going to punch an ox in the face. Both work for me. We're sinking. Bye, pa pack and bagums. I survived ten days. Ten just wandering days. I was betting there would be an island right in the middle of this infinite blackness, and nothing. Ha <sighs>